They would have Necron take on Tombstone. Oh boy. Now, uh, I don't know how. Alright. I think we all know who wins this one. So let's just see if there's like a, any possible way of Tombstone winning. Because we can all agree Necron's winning this one. So, Necron is stronger, faster, and more durable, and definitely more invulnerable. I mean, it took the entire DC universe to get by, I believe, like, some of them, a few DC characters, like, Scarecrow, Lex Luthor, Barry Allen, to get Lantern Rings just to take them down, just to create a uh, White Lantern Ring. It takes the White Lanterns really to, to hold their own against Necron, so, already, and I also say Necron is more intelligent. Maybe Tombstone is the better strategist when it comes to plans, but Necron is more intelligent. Tombstone is a better fighter than Necron. I think we can all agree Tombstone is a much, much better fighter, but it's not going to do him any good. Now, Tombstone has has. Kind of struggle with Spider-Man, Luke Cage, and Daredevil. Those things alone kind of elevate that more likely than not he's going to struggle up against Batman or even Green Lantern. Um, God, I don't even know why I'm doing this fight. Uh, I like legit. I was thinking of like doing it by me. I believe there's. Now, I'm going to set this up into, like, few scenarios. What if Tombstone had the Speed Force, Atlantean Powers, uh, a green, uh, Lantern Ring, all of them? And the same with Speed Force, Still Force, Sage Force, or Forever Force, and, or uh, a Black Lantern, etc. So I'm just going to put up the three of them, or I guess, yeah, yeah, three of them. I guess two of them, I guess, Speed Force and Green Lantern. So what if Nick Tombstone had, like, Atlantean or like the Speed Force powers. Well, Atlantean not gonna do him any good, but Speed Force differently. Maybe the Speed Force, no. Still Force, a little bit. Strength Force, no. And same with the Sage Force, no. Well, maybe the Sage Force, kinda, because you know, he can show him um, Necron his greatest fears. But I mean, that's not gonna do him any good against Necron, who can also do the same with Tombstone. Um, the negative speed force on the other end, completely different story. With the negative speed force, I actually would say Tombstone would win that fight. You know, because, it's like, in a Flashpoint storyline in DC, when Barry Allen changed the timeline, the negative speed force was not affected, so maybe Tombstone can go back in time and erase Necron from existing, Meaning, but that would not, and with the negative speed force, um, it won't change the timeline. So, that's one p potential way Tombstone can win. Where he can just erase him from, ex from existence before ever. And now, that's not cheating. It's not like BFR, where that literally is cheating, or you're disqualified. I, erasing you from existence is one of the most is one of the main powers that um, the speed force, that the speed force or negative speed force or time travel in general has. So you're not disqualified, right? Because you, you it's one of your abilities. Where BFR, it's like, okay, I'm just gonna kick you. We're fighting, say, San Francisco. I'm just gonna kick you all the way to like Asia. It means I completely won. That does not mean anything. In fact, you cheated. Because you're not using what you have. So that's one way uh, Tombstone can win is through the negative speed force. Anything other than, I guess even the forever force or all the forces together. Um, something like that. Tombstone sh no, should have an edge. But apart from negative speed force and the forever force, no way. <laughs> So the forces is one way Tombstone can win. Now let's go on to the Lantern Rings. 
Okay, it was uh, uh, now this one Tombstone should win instantly. I mean, all I mean Necron was defeated by uh, a Red Lantern Mera, Orange Lantern Lex Luthor, a Yellow Lantern Scarecrow, a Blue Lantern Barry Allen. Uh, I think it was a, a Star Sapphire Wonder Woman, Green Lantern. I'm trying to think of anyone else. I, I know there's. I keep forgetting who was the Indigo one. I, I don't know, but uh, I'm pretty sure Tombstone should win if he had the Lantern ring. So, so who wins this fight? Well, if it's with the forces or a Lantern ring. Tombstone has a potential way of actually getting a victory. Apart from that, Necron wins 10 times out of 10. But when you think I love you, you don't have to sign up in the comment down below. And as always, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.